You know, and let's uh, talk about one of the favorite uh, cold cons uh, 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 a plotter and schemers was Arlene Spencer. And now I have the whole police department on my back all the time. I don't want to just talk too loud because I'll have seven or eight officers here. That's what she was doing all those years when I spoke up about the nursing homes. You know what she was doing? She was having a party all the time. She couldn't wait to have my portfolio st uh, stolen. She couldn't wait to have my for uh, photography stolen. She couldn't wait to destroy my business because she didn't want to do anything. She don't want to do her own job as being a mother and she didn't want to fucking go to work. She couldn't wait to do this. She was too busy plotting and scheming to have all these po fucking police attack me. Do you know what it's like to be a middle-aged woman in middle pause and have a bunch of 30-year-olds standing around telling you you're garbage all the time? And here's Arlene Spencer snickering and laughing how they all like to party at her house and they all like to have a good time and everybody loves her and everybody hates me and I can't get a job and I can't have a car and I can't have my uh, place to live and nobody loves me. It was always a in my marriage because her and Flan. Oh, Arlene and Flan. Arlene and Flan. So this is the kind of filthy shit that goes on. And then I have her sons threatening me to stay away from them. Can you imagine? She's been stalking me since I was a kid. Since she was hanging out with Mary Alice and my, and my molester fucking cousin. These women have been at it. So don't tell me about fucking work. These women, I've heard that for years, how superior she was, how great she was, what a family person she was, how she didn't have to work. You know what her work was? Plotting and scheming. So here I am, here I am, and they continue this. She didn't give a shit about the residents at the nursing home. She didn't give a shit about anything because she didn't have to do nothing because all she did was sit around and plot and scheme with these men so they could go around and terrorize women like me me with a badge and a gun so I don't want to talk too loud because yes they're just plotting and scheming Tuesday so I can't even live in an abandoned house I can't live anywhere here without this constant filthy police harassment